During President Trump's news conference yesterday, he criticized reporters for spreading what he calls fake news. Now, it's something we've heard a lot about over the past several months, and now teachers are even incorporating it into their lesson plans. WNCT's Jessica Joel joins us now in the newsroom with details. Jessica. Many of us have learned the telltale signs of fake news, yet your kids may not know. That's why some teachers from elementary school all the way through college are starting to talk about it. Many teachers say curbing fake news can start in the classroom. The goal is teaching your kids how to distinguish fact from fiction and why they should care about the difference. They're learning to use common sense to question stories and to look critically at web addresses and authors. It's happening in schools in our area too, including GR Whitfield. I say majority of the people that get their news, especially the younger ones, are getting them from social media. And so they're not actually seeking it out, it's just kind of popping up on their account. So since they're doing that younger and younger, we need to teach them at a younger age how to identify what's legitimate. Social media sites are also taking note. Facebook is working with fact-checking organizations to come up with new measures to prevent fake news stories from being shared. Now, here's why this is so important. A recent Stanford study shows more than 80% of students cannot tell whether news is fake or legitimate. Jessica Jewell, 9 on your side.